Oh, good. You're here. His Highness seems to have caught a mild case of madness this morning. You were right when you said that this was our chance. I was. I propose we make a commotion. Lure out the Templar-controlled British Indies Company. And do what? Put yourself in the line of fire? I need to send Ellsworth a message. Please this won't be over until we can draw him out. This is something I must do. I will make a scene, and then you need to rough them up a little. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. I've heard you Templars are a bunch of pansies. Here we go. Not looking so tough now, are ya? Please spare me! I need you to send a message to Ellsworth. I'll do anything! Tell him. Oh my God. Meet me at Lambert Cemetery tonight and tell him to come alone. It happened right in front of me! Murder! Bloody hell! It's murder! Meet me tonight at Lambert Cemetery. He'll never come alone, even if I ask him to. That caused quite a commotion. He's gone mad. Greeny was right. He isn't mad, Jacob. He's trying to take action. To do the right thing. Oh, never mind. I'll take it from here. Fine by me. I could use a good pint right about now. Oh. I was expecting Jacob, but I'm glad it's you who have come. He thinks you've gone mad. I probably have. What's your plan? I've asked Brinley to meet me here alone. In turn, he, of course, has sent a small army to secure the area. I need you to get rid of them and meet me back here. It's essential that when Brinley does arrive, I have him to myself. Understood. Nothing's gonna slip past me. We have a visit. <laughs> Go 
skull is here! <laughs> That will certainly help quite a bit, thank you. He's here. I must talk to him. Don't be absurd, this is dangerous. Miss Fry, this is something I must do, and I must do it alone. Remain hidden. I cannot afford to have him see you. You can't escape me forever, your highness. Come out and face me. I told you to meet me here alone. Not as silly as I once was, Sing. I wouldn't dare come to this meeting place alone, not with your recently acquired friends. I am alone, Elswith. It doesn't have to be like this. You can't just walk this earth like a free man. You are nothing more than a trophy, a stag's head above a mantelpiece. You've caused enough commotion as it is. It's time to put an end to this. If you kill me now, you will be a wanted man. Imagine the uprising when they find out the only son of Ranjit Singh has been murdered. Good. <laughs> you think they remember you? You are a lost soul. A monarch who has abandoned his people. You are nothing. We were such good friends. Friends? <clears throat> You were no more than a plaything. A prisoner in prince's clothing. You're lucky to be alive. I admit, I was surprised they let you live. One less crash for us to worry about. Ugh, I've had enough of this. You mustn't! Miss Guy! He will kill you! This is what I was sent here for. Be done with it, girl! I shall never forfeit my own mission. I will not allow it. The Loggins, the company, they all wanted your silence. Whether you spare me or end me, you won't escape the fate they have planned for you. It seems you have learnt nothing of India, of its people. But killing you? That is something I cannot do. It would make me no better than the cursed, oppressive company you work for. Yeah. You will die as you were raised, Singh. You'll never be more than a, a trophy of war. We will bury you in English soil. <laughs> you have done me much good. I am heavily indebted to you both. We are happy to help. I fear that I cannot continue handling things in this manner. The assassin way is not my way. As helpful as you have been. This empire, this land, my people. The problem is so much bigger than death. I know I must devote my life to this cause, to put India, my home, back onto the map, return it to its people. It's a long and grueling journey, but it is something I must do, even if it takes me to my own death. We understand, Your Highness. But if you do change your mind, you know where to find us. That I do. Thank you, Assassins. Hopefully, we never shall meet again. Just in passing, I think you should smarten up a bit. <laughs>